Hi, I'm Johnny Geis, and I'm the Upper Fresh Region reporter living on the world famous Lake Fork. I'd like to show you how to uh, tie a drop shot rigging, and it's a real effective technique, for, especially for light line. I'm going to use some colored braid tonight, It'll be easier to see. And the first thing I like to do is start out by putting a swivel on one end of it so it won't twist your line up so much. We're going to take the we're gonna take the hook. That's what you do with the drop shot. You drop the hook. We take the hook. And we're gonna drop right through the hook. We're gonna go right down the other way, and I'm gonna tie a polymer knot. It's a real easy knot to tie, and it's about halfway down. You can make a drop shot any length you want to make it, but I like to make it about uh, five or six inches from it. Sometimes about the, as long as your bait's an effective way to do it. Just a regular polymer knot around this hook. Voila, and I've got the nice hook right there tied, ready to go. Now, if you'll notice, when you lift this drop shot up, that hook is down, okay? You always want it to kind of be up with the barb up. If for some reason you tie it and the barb is down, you can actually come back through the hook before you put your weight on, drop your line right back through the same eye, and then tie your weight on. Now, what kind of weight do you use? I like to use a cylindrical weight. It comes right through the vegetation very good. Notice one other thing. I actually opened the eye of this cylindrical deal because I like to tie it on instead of pinch it on because you'll lose a lot of weights if you don't. But just play like that. That's the eye of a bait. You tie it on and you can use a polymer knot or the trilene knot. Either kind of works. It's worked this one out here. It's not a polymer knot, but it works great. We'll take that off, cut off the tag end. You don't have to, but I always like to get the tag in off the line. And voila, we've got a drop shot rig. We tie it on the end of your line here at this, this side. There's the weight. Now, how do you put your worm on? Two ways. Nose hooking is real effective, especially on a finesse style bait. All you have to do is put it right there. The weight's on the bottom, the worm's right there, and you have a drop shot. Uh, if you have a J-hook, you can actually text as rig this worm and it'll be weedless, a lot better to do, but this will catch a lot of fish. Cast out your drop shot, let the weight hit the bottom and just a slight shaking of the rod tip and the worm will be twitching all the way down the line. Bass can't resist that and you can change the distance between the bottom of your weight to the hook. If you're in deep vegetation, you might want it to be longer than that. And if it's just a regular hard bottom, you can get shorter. But this is the general style of a drop shot, a real effective way to catch a lot of fish. If you'd like to have more te techniques of rigging, subscribe to Captain Rick Murphy's YouTube channel. We'll be sure to cover a lot of new techniques this year.